In January of this year, a white rhino calf was born at White Oak Conservation Center, a captive breeding and research facility located in northeast Florida. Due to health reasons and extremely cold temperatures, the calf had to be pulled when he was three days old and is now being hand-raised by White Oak's animal staff. Because of the dedication of his caregivers and the enormous amount of formula they make on a weekly basis, George is thriving. What follows is a short video journal of how rhino milk is made using lactase drops by seeking health. Lots of rhino milk. Currently, George weighs 664 pounds. He is drinking about eight and a half gallons a day, uh, spread out into five feedings. Um, the lactase is put in the formula with the cow's milk, non-fat and 1% cow's milk, to help break down the lactose in the milk and it breaks it down and puts it, makes it into simple sugars to make it more digestible. And this formula is 27 parts non-fat cow's milk, 9 parts 1% cow's milk, 1 part dextrose, 3 parts water. And the dextrose solution will get more dilute as he gets older. In each gallon we put 30 drops of lactase. But we make our formula in a five gallon jug and then we divide it into the gallon container. And then put the drops in. We'll get her locked up this afternoon, her and her Dina, just keep them out of the way.